Today I'm going to show you how to make a really simple, realistic looking fire candle to light up your pumpkin for Halloween or, or a candle or whatever with your Arduino Uno. This is a uh, generic model, but it works just the same. This uh, project is so easy and you'll do it so quickly that um, you can use any Arduino, even a Tiduino, as long as you have three uh, PWM ports, it will work. And these parts are available at your local Radio Shack, so so simple to do. You need one pack of 330 ohm, one fourth watt is fine resistors. These are pretty cheap, and uh, a red, not very bright, but it's good enough. Make sure that it is a red cover and a yellow. They come in a pack of two. Notice they're much brighter. Let's focus on that. There you go. And they come two of them in a pack. With these, we're going to make a very realistic fire. And an Uno. Now if you have a, this is optional, but if you have a battery pack to run your device, it'll um, make it a lot more fun. And let's get started. All right, let me show you what we've done here. Um, I have wired our three resistors to output 9, 10, and 11 because they have pulse width modulation. The way you know it has that, there's a squiggly line next to the numbers. And um, on this board, it uses pound signs, but the Arduino Uno model has six of these uh, pulse width modulation lines. We're only going to need 9, 10, or 11, and 11. And on the LED, what we've done is the resistors are connected to the positive side of the LEDs, one each. And the ground side is all on the same rail of the breadboard and connected with this ground cable to the ground pin, G and D. Um, with on the LEDs here's a close-up of one the way you know which is the ground side it's the shorter side the shorter leg is your negative ground side now to the sketch as you can tell this is the smallest shortest easiest script you're ever gonna write to make a candle pretty much we set up pin 9 10 and 11 as outputs we set up the loop. I'll copy and paste this into the uh, onto the file so you can copy it. We're gonna analog out a random number plus 135 so it's always bright, and then we're gonna delay to a random of up to 100. So it's very realistic. Even we don't even know how uh, it's gonna come out. Really simple, really short. That's all you need, and you can actually upload it to uh, upload your sketch and uh, we will test it it's under two kilobits of space so it will work with all, all right let's give it a whirl turn on the power pack let it boot all right and uh, what you will see it is randomly flashing um, the red is to blend with the brighter yellow so it actually looks like a real uh, fire candle right now you can't tell how fast it's flashing even on the camera and to my eyes but um, we're gonna cover it up and uh, you'll see when I turn the light off and this is the effect you get this is a regular cup um, that I cut the top off just for demonstration purposes but it actually is very bright where it actually goes pretty well through the paper cup it's a thick cup but uh, like this just looks like three lights but that red really adds to that yellow to those yellows which are also brighter and it gives it the uh, the candle effect and it's random it's a very short skit uh, sketch I mean and uh, it's very fun to do easy to run and you can use it on your pumpkin or work from there 
So have fun with it and uh, enjoy. Thank you for watching.